Teresa here wanting to say I miss you and hope all of you are doing well. We are doing this video for you today so we can still help you with your walk with Jesus. So to start with, we're going to do our worship song. You all know it, so if you want to, get up and do it with us. And then our lesson for the week. hearing two people give you commands. How many of you obeyed the first captain? How many of you the second? In life we will also hear two voices inside of us. Two different things. One voice is from God and one is from the devil. Just as you had to choose which captain to obey, you have to choose which voice to obey. Whenever you do something wrong, such as telling a lie, you choose, you are choosing to obey Satan. Whenever you do something right, like telling the truth, you are choosing to obey God. Our key verse for lesson nine is, you shall not give false testimony against your neighbor. Exodus 20:16. So we all go through times, we might do something, we might get into a fight with our brother or sister, and although you may have caused it, you might blame them for it. So that's like not telling the truth, right? So when we go through this and we don't tell the truth, we're not only hurting us, we're hurting God, we're hurting the person that we're lying about. So we need to be really careful and not give false testimonies against each other. Our brothers and sisters, yes, they are family, but it, uh, as Jesus is concerned and the Bible says, everyone is our neighbor. And it doesn't matter if you're living next door to somebody, it's somebody that you, you cross the street and, and meet is your neighbor as well. So just be cautious, stand firm in your faith, and remember that when you're telling the truth, you're doing what God wants you to do, and you're following one of the commandments to not covet, or not to lie against your neighbor. So um, just keep that in mind, and I'll say a little prayer for everybody. Um, that uh, and just Heavenly Father, we just lift up all the girls 
we know that we're going through a tough time right now and we can't be together. And just pray that everybody is staying safe, staying healthy, and that soon this virus is going to just go away and that we will all be back together in uh, Girls Club. And we just thank you and praise you for everything you do for us. You are our provider, our healer, and our protector. And we know that you are in control of this situation. 